What are the strongest military vehicles in the Philippines Army? What powerful machines do they rely on? And how do they stand up to some of the world's most advanced forces? Well, today we'll find out together as we showcase the top 10 most powerful military vehicles of the Philippine Army. This list focuses exclusively on land vehicles, with warships and aircraft saved for future contents. But before we dive in, don't forget to like and subscribe if you want fresh rankings every day. And now, let's get started. Number 10, FS-100 Simba. The GKN Simba FS-100 is a 4x4 armored personnel carrier developed in the United Kingdom by GKN Defense during the late 1980s. Primarily produced for export, it was adopted exclusively by the armed forces of the Philippines in the early 1990s, with 150 units entering service. While some units were directly imported, most were assembled locally under license. Weighing approximately 11 metric tons in combat configuration, the Simba is powered by a Perkins 210 horsepower, six-cylinder turbocharged diesel engine. This provides a top speed of 100 kilometers per hour on roads in a range of up to 660 kilometers. The vehicle is 5.35 meters long, 2.5 meters wide, and 2.59 meters high. The Simba's steel armor protects against small arms fire and shrapnel. Number 9 VP3 Bigfoot. The Bigfoot is a Chinese manufactured mine resistant ambush protected vehicle developed by Poly Technologies. This four wheel drive armored vehicle is designed for troop transport and patrol missions, particularly in hazardous environments. The Philippine Army has incorporated the VP3 into its fleet to bolster its armored capabilities in counterinsurgency and security operations. The Bigfoot weighs approximately 14 tons and features all-around armor protection against small arms fire and explosive threats. It can accommodate up to 12 personnel, including the driver and commander. The vehicle is equipped with a roof-mounted turret capable of supporting a heavy machine gun or automatic grenade launcher, enhancing its combat versatility. Its engine delivers 300 horsepower, providing a top speed of 100 kilometers per hour and a range of 600 kilometers, making it suitable for extended operations in diverse terrains. Number 8. Iveco Guarani The Iveco VBTP-MR Guarani is a six-wheeled amphibious armored personnel carrier jointly developed by Iveco Defense Vehicles and the Brazilian Ministry of Defense. Designed for the Brazilian Army, it is manufactured in Brazil and has also been exported to countries like Ghana and Argentina. This modern vehicle replaces older models such as the EE-11 Urutu, providing enhanced mobility and protection for diverse combat scenarios. The Gorani measures 6.91 meters in length, 2.7 meters in width, and 2.34 meters in height, with a weight of 14.5 metric tons, empty, and a gross weight of 17.7 metric tons. Powered by an Avico Cursor 9 diesel engine producing 383 horsepower, it can reach speeds exceeding 90 kilometers per hour on roads and is fully amphibious. Number 7. KLTVK-151 The Kia Light Tactical Vehicle, also known as the K-151, is a versatile 4x4 platform developed by Kia Motors Corporation of South Korea. It is designed for a range of military missions, including troop transport, reconnaissance, and command operations. The vehicle comes in multiple configurations, including armored and unarmored variants. Powered by a 225 horsepower turbocharged diesel engine, the KLTV can reach speeds of up to 130 kilometers per hour and has an operational range of 600 kilometers. Its modular chassis supports standard and long wheelbase models, accommodating up to four passengers in the armored version and eight in the extended variant. The vehicle's armored configuration offers protection up to Stanig Level 2, safeguarding against small arms fire and shrapnel. Number 6. M113 A2 Plus IFV The M113 A2 Plus Infantry Fighting Vehicle is an upgraded variant of the classic M113 armored personnel carrier currently serving in the Philippine Army. 
The modernization program includes the integration of advanced turrets and enhanced weapon systems. Some units feature the Elbit Systems UT-25 unmanned turret, armed with a 25mm autocannon, and options for coaxial machine guns or guided anti-tank missiles. These electronically stabilized turrets allow for accurate firing on the move and offer superior situational awareness with no compromise on internal armor integrity. The upgrades were part of contracts between the Philippines and suppliers like Elbit Systems and FNSS, improving the vehicle's combat versatility. The platform retains its diesel engine and a weight of around 11 tons, offering reliable mobility and protection. Enhanced firepower and adaptability have made the M113A 2 Plus an essential asset in the Philippine military's modernization efforts. Number 5 FV101 Scorpion The Scorpion is a British light reconnaissance tank designed by Alvis Vehicles in the 1960s and introduced into service in the 1970s. As part of the Combat Vehicle Reconnaissance Series, it was built for high mobility, compactness, and versatility. Its lightweight design makes it air transportable, with a combat weight of approximately 8.1 tons. The Scorpion was initially powered by a Jaguar J60 gasoline engine, but later upgraded to a Cummins diesel engine, producing 190 horsepower, giving it a maximum road speed of 81 kilometers per hour and an operational range of 644 kilometers. The primary armament is a 76mm Royal Ordnance Cannon, complemented by a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. The vehicle also features eight smoke grenade launchers for added defensive capability. Its aluminum armor provides protection against small arms fire and shrapnel, and the vehicle accommodates a crew of three. Number 4. AIFV-25 the AIFV-25 is an evolution of the M113 armored personnel carrier designed by FMC Corporation. It combines the mobility and durability of the M113 with improved offensive capabilities, featuring a one-person turret armed with a 25mm autocannon and a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. It carries up to eight infantry soldiers in addition to its three-person crew, consisting of a driver, commander, and gunner. Powered by a Detroit Diesel Allison 6V53T engine, generating 270 horsepower, the AIF V25 has a top speed of 60 km per hour and a range of up to 500 km. Its combat weight is approximately 13.6 metric tons, and the vehicle provides basic protection against small arms and shrapnel, with optional upgrades for improved armor. The AIFV-25 is currently in use by the Philippine Army, with 45 units acquired for infantry support operations. This vehicle combines versatility and firepower, making it suitable for various mission profiles. Number 3. Sabra Ascod 2 The Ascod 2 light tank is a modern armored combat vehicle developed by Elbit Systems of Israel. Based on the ASCOD-2 platform, this tank is tailored to meet the needs of light-armored warfare while maintaining mobility and adaptability. The Philippine Army has ordered 20 track Sabra units, which are expected to enhance its mechanized capabilities. The Sabra ASCOD-2 is equipped with a 105mm rifled gun as its primary weapon, capable of engaging both armored and soft targets effectively. Its secondary armament includes a coaxial machine gun and a roof-mounted weapon station, providing versatility in combat scenarios. The vehicle is powered by a high-performance diesel engine, enabling a top speed of approximately 70 km per hour on roads. It offers a range of up to 500 km, ensuring operational flexibility. With advanced modular armor, the tank provides protection against small arms fire, shell fragments, and mines. Number 2. Atmos 2000 The Atmos 2000 is a self-propelled howitzer designed by Elbit Systems of Israel. It is a versatile artillery system mounted on a 6x6 truck chassis, offering high mobility and rapid deployment. The system features a 155mm howitzer with a range of up to 41 km, depending on the ammunition used. Its advanced fire control system enables accurate targeting making it effective for both direct and indirect fire support. 
The Atmos 2000 is powered by a diesel engine, providing ample power for maneuvering in challenging terrains. The vehicle's modular design allows it to be customized for various operational needs, including adding protective armor for crew safety. Recently, the Philippine Army received these systems to enhance its artillery capabilities, reflecting the vehicle's reputation for reliability and performance in modern warfare. Number 1. Pandor 2 The Pandor 2 is a highly versatile wheeled armored vehicle developed by General Dynamics European Land Systems and manufactured under license by Tatra Defense Vehicle in the Czech Republic. It is widely used by the Czech Army and other international forces. The Pandur 2 features a modular design with a welded self-supporting hull that offers protection levels up to Stanig 4, 569, level 4 for ballistic and mine resistance. It is equipped with systems to counter chemical, biological, and nuclear threats and is transportable by NATO standard aircraft. This vehicle can be customized for various roles, including infantry fighting, command, medical evacuation, reconnaissance, and fire support. The standard configuration is powered by a Cummins ISLE six-cylinder diesel engine paired with a ZF automatic transmission, delivering excellent mobility with a range of approximately 700 kilometers and a top speed of 105 kilometers per hour. As we conclude our exploration, we hope you've been inspired by the power of these powerful machines. Which one impressed you the most? Let us know in the comment below. And don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see much more rankings like this.